and I will strike down upon thee with great vengeance and furious anger those who attempt to poison and destroy my brothers. And you will know my name is the Lord when I lay my vengeance upon thee. today thanks for watching rivalry week hate week scc versus acc you know we let that we let the acc have have their fun last year didn't we let them have a little something let them win a few games against the scc hell we even let them win a national title that's coming to a screech at halt this year the acc back down to a middle of the road conference where, where, you know right where they belong right where they're used to being georgia georgia tech I talked about this game already once this week, and I'm probably going to talk about it again tomorrow uh, because I hate the nerves that damn much. They, they deserve at least one more video this week, so I, I'll probably talk about that one again tomorrow. But the nerds have no chance. This trade school is going down hard on Saturday. Georgia Tech might well not even show up. Hell, you already gave up one game this year. You might as well just give up another one, finish your season off at 5-5. Five and five. That way... You can tell people you didn't have a losing record. Because after this Saturday, that's exactly what you're going to have. You're going to be 5-6. and six. You're finishing up the season with a losing record. You have absolutely zero chance against UGA. None! No chance! I have to make myself stop or I could just keep going off on you. You, you, you people make me so damn mad the way y'all acted last year after y'all beat us. You idiot fans, the, the, the team, every... I, Louisville, 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 whatever the hell you want to be called, uh, how about we just call you loser? You're not beating Kentucky. That's not happening. How do I know this? Simple. You're not nearly as good as you were last year, and you couldn't even beat Kentucky last year. L Lamar Jackson, you, you guys are literally, you, you're the definition of a one-man band. I almost feel sorry for this guy, Lamar Jackson. Stuck on this nothing team with a bunch of nobodies. Basketball team crumbling down around you. Football team probably next. This scam artist, Bobby Petrino. What a joke. What an embarrassment this guy is. Bobby Petrino, I wouldn't piss on you if you were on fire, sir. If you were drowning and Uncle Lou was the only one around to save you, it would depend what clothes I had on, whether you lived or died, son. Kentucky is beating you. Sorry. Not sorry! Florida State, this all-girls clown college, Free Shoes University, the criminals, head coach trying to fight his own fans on the field after games, lose one player in the opening game of the season, and then can't win one friggin' game for the first six weeks of the season.
If losing one player, listen, you just weren't any good to start with. Now that's just reality. You can't lose one player and then you don't make a bowl game trying to tell me, well, we would have been a top five team. Bowl! You're just, you're not a good team. Period. Period. Your coach is packing his bags as we speak. He can't wait to get out of town. I'm not even going to get into his whole messy divorce situation and all that and what his wife was or was not doing and what he was or was not doing. I, that ain't none of my concern. Point is, this man's trying, probably trying to get out of town. Yeah, Texas A&M, uh, somewhere, the moon, this guy's willing to go anywhere to get out of Tallahassee. I don't blame him. Dumpster fire down there. Dumpster fire! Yeah, I know, Florida not that good either. But they're good enough to beat you! With no coach! One of the most meaningless and pointless uh, moral victory bragging points is about to come to a close for the criminals! We've made a bowl game for years in a row. 11 or whatever the hell it is. 35. I don't know. But you ain't making one this year because the Florida Gators are waxing your ass. You're losing. Taters. Clemson. What a podunk town that is, Clemson. It ain't nothing but Auburn with a lake. That's it. You lost to a fruit. You lost to Syracuse. Your coach is on the Uncle Lou doo-doo list too. This guy cares about nothing but winning. This yabba dabba dabbo Swinney. Yabba dabba doo! Yabba dabba dabbo! Played Deshaun Watson with a torn ACL. Could have ruined that man's career! Go up to Fruit University, Syracuse. Quarterback hobbling around with one leg! You make him go out there and play. The guy can't hardly pass to start with. He's nothing but a running quarterback. You put him out there with one damn leg. Almost got him killed with that Swiss cheese offensive line you had against the Fruit College. Man gets slammed down, cracks his skull. Concussion! Has to come out. You blame that for the loss. I blame you! Yabba dabba doo! South Carolina is beating you. Forget the playoff. You still go to the ACC championship game playing the also ran ball against Miami, but you're not beating South Carolina. That's not happening. That's not happening. Jake Bentley, better than whatever quarterback you running out there. And that's just the reality of the situation. That game in Columbia, too? Yeah, yeah. Said it's in Columbia. You're losing! SEC going 4 0 in these games. Daddy, back on top, son. We're fixing to bend you over. Spank that little bottom blue.